Pombong, officially the municipality of Pombong, Tagalog, Bayan ng Pombong, is a third-class municipality in the province of Bulacan, Philippines. According to the 2015 census, it has a population of 53,294 people, dubbed as the vinegar capital of the Philippines. Pombong is famous for its vinegar extracted from the sap of sasa, nipa, thus the term, suking pombong. Pombong vinegar became known in Luzon and other parts of the Philippines. Etymology Local legend has it that the name, Pombong, was taken from the long bamboo tube called, Bumbong, or, Tukul, which is used for collecting nipa sap. The practice of extracting nipa sap with bumbongs made the town known as the town with many bumbongs. The local people claimed that the Spaniards who first visited the place were so amused with the bumbong that, after learning its name from the natives, they named the town after the container, a name which later evolved to Pombong. History Pombong was originally one of the visitas barrio of Malolos mentioned in Capitulo 36 of Conquistas de los Ila Libro Segundo by Fray Gaspar San Agustin. In a meeting held in Tondo Convent, the provincial chapter created the town of Malolos in June 1580 with Fray Matheo de Mendoza OSA as its first minister, together with barrios of Mombog under the patronage of San Roque, Matimbo with Santa Cruz, and Pombong with St. James Apostle. In 1619, Augustinians already established Pombong Convent, but the town was administered by the Justice of Friars from Malolos. Pombong is not wealthy as its neighbor towns of Malolos and Haganoy at time, and it did not sustain its township, and it was degraded again as barrio and being a visita in 1638. In 1639, Pombong was turned over to the town of Calumpit from its mother town Malolos, and in 1649 it was returned again to Malolos but on November 28, 1650 it was finally given its own civil government establishing Pombong its full township with Don Agustin Manangaya as its first governor Silo. In the middle of the 1750s, Pombong grew into a modest community from what was once a Kogon land inhabited by a handful of Tagalogs, as its first governor Silo. During the revolution against Spain, Pombong's coastal area, more specifically, Barangays Masukal and Binacod, played a significant role in Philippine history being known in counter sites between Spanish soldiers and Katipuneros. Malolaño General Isidora Matanglawan Torres used to retreat with his troops to Barangay Masukal and Barangay Binacod to avoid the advancing Spanish forces. In the latter village, he organized the Katipunan militia of Pombong. It is from these encounters, in fact, that Barangays Binacod and Masukal earned their present names. In one encounter, Binacod was where the enemies were fenced in Binacuran, and it was in Masukal where they were eventually cornered Nasikol, and defeated. In 1898, the first civilian in the person of Don Victorio de Leon headed the municipal government until 1900. The seat of the local government was first established at the ground floor of the Pombong Church Convent then popularly called Zaguan. It was later transferred to the house of Numerino Lindeag located in Poblacion, then was transferred to the location of the present Rural Health Center I. Eventually it was moved to the place where it is presently located which since has been the seat of the municipal government since then. In 1941, the head of the municipal government was later on called municipal mayor. Geography Pombong is situated southwest of the province of Bulacan, with a total land area of 46.34 square kilometers. It is bounded by the municipality of Calumpit on the north, Malolos City on the east, municipality of Haganoy on the west and Manila Bay on the south. The municipality is approximately 47 kilometers from Metro Manila. It is a bypass town and can be accessed via North Luzon Expressway and MacArthur Highway. Barangays Pombong is politically subdivided into 14 barangays, 6 urban, 8 rural. Binacod, this barangay is known for producing rock salt. Capitangan, this barangay is a famous pilgrimage site during the Holy Week, particularly Good Friday. 
Some devout Catholic worshippers flagellate and or allow themselves to be crucified to repent and share in the sufferings of Jesus Christ. Malumo Masukal Pinalagdan Poblacion San Isidro I San Isidro II San Jose – Cradle the largest Sasahan in town, subdivided into seven political sitio or Barak, Sitio Uno, Gitna, Sitio Trace, Sitio Wawa, Sitio Pante, Sito Gunao and Sitio Kulis. It is also a political hot spot every election for national and local positions. The San Jose fish port located at Sitio Wawa cradles the motor boats or Bonca, which serves as the major transportation going to the three barangays near the Manila Bay, namely, Sta. Cruz, Masukal and Binacod. San Roque San Vicente Sta. Cruz, there are two main resources of this barangay, fishponds and asinan, or salt making. In this coastal barangay you can see some salt evaporation ponds. Sto, Niño, formerly known as Tule Nabato because it is the only place then that has a concrete bridge. This is the frontier barangay of Pombong. Sto, Rosario Demographics In the 2015 census, the population of Pombong, Bulacan, was 53,294 people, with a density of 1,200 inhabitants per square kilometer or 3,100 inhabitants per square mile. Local government Just as the national government, the municipal government is divided into three branches, executive, legislative and judiciary. The judicial branch is administered solely by the Supreme Court of the Philippines. The LGUs have control of the executive and legislative branch. The executive branch is composed of the mayor and the barangay captain for the barangays. The legislative branch is composed of the Sangguniang Bayan Town Assembly, Sangguniang Barangay, Barangay Council, and the Sangguniang Kabatan for the youth sector. The seat of government is vested upon the mayor and other elected officers who hold office at the town hall. The Sangguniang Bayan is the center of legislation. Municipal officials the following officials were elected on May 9, 2016 to serve a three-year term. Mayor, Marianne P. Marcos Vice Mayor, Cristina T. Gonzalez Councilors Count. Arnaldo L. Mendoza Count. Zoilo G. Estrella Count. Myrna G. Valencia Count. Marcelino D. Ong Tu Count. Christopher E. Pasco Count. James Jester M. Santos Count. Philip L. Eusebio Count. Marcelino R. de Roxas Economy Major Industries Aquaculture Culturing of milk fish, tilapia, shrimps, oysters, king crab and others Ornamental plants, flowers, used for gardening and landscaping Grass planting, carabao grass, Bermuda grass, blue grass etc. Used for gardening and landscaping Garments food processing, smoked fish and other food products Major products condiments, vinegar, fish sauce, salts, et al. Nipa, weaving of nipa palm leaves Agriculture products rice poultry livestock fisheries fruits and vegetables attraction St. James the Apostle Parish Church the town church of Pombong originally built as Visita of Malolos in 1580 established as parish in 1639 made of light materials it suffered a massive fire causing it to lost its ancient architecture it was reconstructed in the 1970s and reconstructed again in 2003. Ciudad Clementino, the prime resort of the small town was the venue of Sa Sandaling Kailangan Mo Ako Soap Opera. Capitangan Good Friday Crucifixion, international media focuses every Good Friday on the crucifixion at Barangay Capitangan. It is known as a pilgrimage area, spiritual healer's haven and venue of a reenactment of the Passion of Christ is held by local devotees and penitents. 
Transportation Public Land Transport in Pombong is served by provincial buses, jeepneys, for hire tricycles, pedicabs, and UV Express AUVs. Maritime transport is served by motorboats. Both First North Luzon Transit and Baliwag Transit buses passes through the municipality. Health and Nutrition There is one hospital operating in Pombong and a main rural health care center unit. The San Pascual Bailon Maternity Hospital, situated at Barangay Sto. Nino that offers secondary health care services. And the main rural health care center is one of the district rural health center owned and controlled by the provincial government of Bulacan. It offers primary health care services which also includes laboratory and dental and maternity services. Education Private Schools by New Year's Kitty School St. Martin de Porras Catholic School Pombong High School Holy Rosary School of Pombong St. Dominic School in Hanga San Isidro 2 Public Schools Elementary Schools High Schools Capitangan National High School Pinalagdan High School San Roque National High School Sta. Cruz National High School References External links Philippine Standard Geographic Code Philippine Census Information